A 19-year-old Rohingya woman who survived a perilous journey across the Indian Ocean in a rickety boat shared her experience while crying with relief. She was among 174 Rohingya Muslims on board the boat that washed up on the shores of Indonesia's Aceh province this week, all fleeing poverty and persecution. Fatima bin Ismail, a 19-year-old Rohingya woman who survived a perilous journey across the Indian Ocean in a rickety boat, held a phone with shaking hands while on a video call with relatives, crying with relief. She was among 174 Rohingya Muslims on board, the boat that washed up on the shores of Indonesia's Aceh province this week, all fleeing poverty and persecution, hoping for a better life or to reunite with family. The group, originally of around 200 people, set sail from Bangladesh in November. Their boat soon sprang a leak and drifted for 40 days before reaching Indonesia. At least 20 people died on the way, with some leaping off the boat in desperation after it broke down, fearing it would sink. The Rohingya are a Muslim people from mainly Buddhist Myanmar where they have long suffered repression. Around 800,000 were forced into Bangladesh since a crackdown by Myanmar's military in 2017. But thousands have fled in an increasingly desperate conditions in refugee camps there. Many try to reach Muslim-majority Malaysia and Indonesia, which has seen nearly 500 Rohingya reach its shores in the past six weeks, according to UN Refugee Agency.